glad you're here. I'm so glad to be here. Thanks I, uh, for having me. I always feel a little bit guilty when people are pregnant, especially women when they're pregnant, yeah. and then they have to come do the show because it's like a nuisance, you right? Know, well, it's no, I, it's it's a thrill and a pleasure and an honor. <laughs> are you feeling um, okay? I'm feeling fine, feeling Good. fine. But yeah, I flew out and. Everything's just a little more complicated when you're knocked up. What do you have to do? Like, um, what are the well, well, changes? Well, so um, I have to wear compression stockings. Oh, yeah. I should be wearing them all the time, but I definitely like I have to wear them when I fly. Why? Because They're your, your toes dreadful. will explode if no. They so there's a lot of pressure on the lower extremities, right? Right. So it interferes with circulation. So it's harder for the blood to get back up to the Heart. Um, <laughs> anyway, so I hate these things, and so right. I refuse to wear them until it's entirely, you know, essential. So I'm like trying to negotiate the, the putting them on in, in the teeny tiny bathroom on the plane. Oh, you're on the plane putting them on. Yeah, because yeah. it's just the last <laughs> second until we take off, you know. And I'm in there for like 20 freaking minutes, <laughs> and uh, it's you know, there. It turns out compression stockings are are rather tight, right? Yeah, so, well, that's the whole point and, of it. Uh, you're supposed to put them with, uh, you need talcum powder. I didn't have any of that Are stuff. You really so I was to... like, all the limbs were in every direction. And, you know, I, I don't know what they thought I was doing in there, but it was not even. I did not know you're supposed to use talcum powder to put. Yeah, well, that's what my OBGYN suggested. But yeah, I didn't come fully equipped. I don't know. You got I, it to but, but I got them on. Yeah, you got them and on. And I'm here. And it worked. You, you and got the here safely. Flowing. This is. You have, you have a child, and I this do. will be number two. Yes, this is number two. Are I you have ready? A like, do you feel like it went well last time? You did it right? Yeah, I went. You know, it went all right first uh -huh. time. We, I actually got induced, so I knew when we were. Oh, having, gotcha. When the, you know, so that kind of took that, that helped a little bit. But my husband and I were doing last-minute prep work at Bed Bath and Beyond, you know, <laughs> just kind of desperately grabbing things off the shelves. Classic like, yeah, things, yeah. Like as you're trying to assert some control, um, and uh, and people. It happened to be the day that we were going to, you know, have, in, have this person arrive. Happened to be that the day of the finale of Homeland. I guess it was the third season or the se second. Anyway, it oh. was airing. Oh, so wow! So people kept coming up to us in the store saying, "Like, really excited for tonight." <laughs> <laughs> like, how, how do they know? <laughs> Who leaked that? You know? <laughs> oh no, no, they meant the show. They meant the show. They meant the show. <laughs> oh, so, that's very so, strange. Yeah, it was so strange. It was totally coincidental. And so we, I was going to go into the hospital, and I was actually going to get induced the following morning. But uh, you know, I, I went into labor naturally. Well, they hooked me up to the oh. machines, and they were like, "Are you feeling these contractions?" And I was like, "What? No." I'm a very sensitive person, but I was not, that eluded me. Anyway, so it was kind of happening, but I was in real denial because it was just, it had been, it had set in my imagination that this was going to happen. Going to happen on day. a scheduled time. You're right. Yes. Yeah, right. But it was, no, so it was, so it started to really kind of come on uh, throughout the night. And my husband was in the next room sleeping. I was like, he needs his rest, you know. Uh -huh. um, Anyway, and I was, I couldn't get to sleep because I was in, I guess, acute pain. But, yeah. Uh, but, but I didn't really, I wasn't tr clocking any of this. And then it occurred to me, I was like, oh, yeah, the finale aired. I wonder what people thought. So I was like on my phone. I was kind of, oh, and you know, three in the morning or something. What you, when you're looking for, you know, feedback, what you mean is who hates me and how much. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah. So, so I was it's gunning good prep for, for being a parent. Yeah, by the exactly, way. Yeah. exactly. So I, so it didn't take long for me to find the worst possible reviews available on the internet. Wow, that's a double whammy. And it kind of occurred to me. I was like, oh, I think I'm in labor. I think this is happening. And I'm reading bad reviews. <laughs> I don't think it gets more masochistic than that. No, like, yeah. no, no. So yeah, that was. So anyway. Yeah, that's. I not... put the phone down. I was like, enough. This yeah. time you, yeah, you must stay away from your phone completely. Yeah, no, no. I, I've learned, but you know, the, the 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 show has already aired, so we're good. I am Jimmy Kimmel. I hope you enjoyed that video. Hit subscribe, and all your dreams will come true, assuming your dreams are to watch more YouTube videos.